Now is the time to get your flu vaccination. An important milestone in LGBTQ healthcare and COVID-19 continues to spread throughout the state. All this and more coming up on Public Health's monthly update. Thank you for joining us on this October edition of Monthly Update, a program designed to bring you a fresh look at public health in Montgomery County. I'm your host, Dan Suffoletto. COVID-19 continues to spread throughout the state. As of September 28th in Montgomery County, there have been 7,883 cases of COVID-19, 918 hospitalizations, and unfortunately, 163 deaths. In addition, 6,661 people have presumed to be recovered. Public Health continues to provide a call center to answer your questions about COVID-19. Kara Thomas is here to tell us more. The call center is open Monday to Friday, 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. Call us at 937-225-6217 with your questions and concerns. Public Health is proud to announce that it has been designated an LGBTQ healthcare equality leader from the Human Rights Foundation. The HEI is a national benchmarking tool that evaluates healthcare facilities' policies and practices related to the equity and inclusion of their LGBTQ patients, visitors, and employees. Health Commissioner Jeff Cooper is here to tell us more. We are proud that Public Health has achieved an important, major milestone in our efforts to ensure health equity and to make Montgomery County a place where all of our residents can live healthy, safe, and thriving lives. This designation further highlights public health's commitment to improving the health of all people, especially those who identify themselves with communities that have been historically marginalized and stigmatized. Now more than ever, it is important for everyone to receive their yearly flu shot. An increasing number of people hospitalized due to the flu and COVID-19 could lead to severe overcrowding in our hospitals. Hadley Rodebeck is here to tell us more on how you can protect yourself. Thanks, Dan. You may not think of the flu as a serious disease, but complications can lead to severe illness, hospitalization, and even death. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention recommends everyone six months and older to get a flu vaccine every year. Public Health's Immunization Clinic is now offering flu vaccinations to help protect you and your family. Vaccinations are available by appointment and fees are based on your ability to pay. Call the Public Health Clinic Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. at 937-225-4550 to schedule your appointment. October is Sudden Infant Death Syndrome Awareness Month. And here to tell us more is Everyone Reach One's Nancy Moss Van. The Everyone Reach One Maternal and Infant Vitality Task Force invites you to help us raise awareness about safe infant sleep by participating in a fun and friendly photo activity called Safe Sleep Snap. Parents, grandparents, aunts, uncles, anyone can participate by sharing a photo of a baby in a safe sleep area on their social media accounts. Make sure you use the hashtag SafeSleepSnap. And remember, to sleep safe, babies should always sleep alone, on their back, and in an empty crib. Public Health is one of the lead agencies in the Montgomery County Food Equity Coalition. Its mission is to increase community food security in Montgomery County by decreasing food waste, decreasing food insecurity, and increasing the availability of healthy, affordable local food. These topics and more will be discussed at this year's Montgomery County Food Summit. The Montgomery County Food Equity Coalition invites you to join us for the 10th annual Montgomery County Virtual Food Summit on Friday, October 16th, from 9 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. via Zoom. Agenda highlights include an update on the food equity plan, a review of new SNAP policies, an introduction to the food bank compost system, the status of retail grocers, and changes in the farm supply. To register, visit eventbrite.com and search Food Summit. See you there. Thanks for joining us for this inaugural edition of the Public Health Monthly Update and for helping us keep Montgomery County a healthy, safe, and thriving community. Until next time, we continue to remind the public, 
to help us stop the spread of COVID-19 by wearing a mask to help protect yourself, your friends, your family, and your loved ones. Because public health cares. When you need us the most, public health is here for you. Our staff is dedicated to preventing the spread of disease, promoting ways to keep you safe, and protecting our most vulnerable population. We do this for you, our county, so we all may continue to be a healthy, safe, and thriving community. Because public health cares.